Let's write the formula for vanadium 5 phosphate. So the first thing we know, vanadium on the periodic table, that's V. And vanadium is a transition metal. So this 5 here, that tells us it's going to be 5 plus. Phosphate, you're not going to find that on the periodic table. When we see this ATE, that's a polyatomic ion. So you either memorize that the phosphate ion is PO4 3 minus. Or if you're allowed, you look it up on a table of polyatomic ions. So vanadium, that's this metal here, this transition metal. Phosphate, that's a group of nonmetals, polyatomic ion. This is an ionic compound, and these charges here, these charges, they need to balance. We can use a bit of a trick here to make this easier. It's called the crisscross method. So we can take the 3 here and then move the 5 over here. Let's get rid of these charges here. And since we have 5 phosphate ions, we do need to put parentheses around them. That makes the formula for vanadium 5 phosphate V3PO45. If we wanted to check our work, remember the vanadium, each vanadium here is 5 plus, and then each of the phosphates, the whole phosphate is 3 minus. 5 times 3 minus, that's minus 15. 3 times 5 plus, that's plus 15. So these charges here, they balance out. This is the correct formula for vanadium 5 phosphate. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.